I don't know. Um, I don't know. I, you know, when I, I sing a song like that, I, I realize that I may need to rethink a little bit about who I am as a as a performer because um, before I came to New York, <clears throat> I was a, an actor and a cabaret singer in Chicago, and um, I was pretty much known as being the goofy guy, you know, the uh, one who does all the spoofs and the crazy jokes, big funny guy. And, um, you know, I, uh, both Becky and I have won the uh, Chicago equivalent of the Mac Award, which is called the, the After Dark Award. So, so, yeah. And, um, yeah, so I was known as the crazy goofy guy, and I, I came here to New York, and, you know, now that I'm, now that I'm a gigantic television star, I really, I just, and Becky doesn't even know that this is happening, but I, I just feel like I need to start taking myself a little more seriously, and, um, and I think it needs to start tonight. <laughs> Something has changed. Something is not the same. I'm through with playing by the rules of my smart assy game. So long to clever spoofing. I can do that in my sleep. It's time to squash my instincts. Close my eyes. And leap. It's time to try defying parody. I think I'll try defying parody and sing the songs as is. I'm through with being brilliant. It sucks to be unique. From this day on, I choose to sing like every YouTube freak. Too long I've been afraid of singing songs sarcasm free. Well, if that sells more tickets, what the hell? Let's see. If I get by defying parody, kiss me goodbye. I'm defying parody. Ray has lost its clown. <laughs> Becky, come with me. Think what we could do together. Limited. Together we're limited. Together we'll be the blandest team there's ever been. Becky, if we work in tandem. You're so frickin' random. No more after darks to win. When you and I Underwhelm this town. So if you dare to find me, head to Manhattan's ports. As someone told me lately, you should sing the songs of Stephen Schwartz. But if I sing it plainly, God knows that isn't me. Besides, I failed already. This whole song's been a parody. So why should I defy the parody? Should I sing high and I thrive on parody? And that shouldn't bring me down. For nobody in cabaret can touch my smart ass skills today. I'll stay the biggest nut in 